Hello and welcome to the channel. My name is Vijay and I am a Microsoft MVP in SharePoint. In today's video, we are going to see how we can delete all items from a SharePoint list using Power Automate or Microsoft Flow. So the requirement is straightforward. So I have a SharePoint list which are there are a few items in this, and I want to delete all these items by uh, from Microsoft Flow or Power Automate. So uh, basically let's say you want to delete all the items every day if you want if you want to schedule it let's say every week whatever the items will be there you want to delete it so in that case you can create a flow uh, you don't ne really need to uh, uh, delete it manually so the flow will do the work for you uh, but in this case we will see here how we can uh, create a button flow or where you can install it you can run it and do that so for this what i'll do is i will go to uh, flow.microsoft.com so you can see here um, now if you have not signed in then it will ask you to put your credentials so make sure you have the license and um, then you log in with that uh, user and then you will come up with uh, with this page where you can see cl create is there plus create and uh, you have multiple options here for example here uh, start from blank start from template uh, and then start from a connector but in this particular case you can see here the, the name the naming has been changed a little bit you can see here instant cloud flow schedule uh, cloud flow and desktop flow as well we will cover all these topics but in this case what we will do here is i will select instant cloud flow uh, now when you will select instant cloud flow you can see here it is saying trigger manually as needed here trigger by a designated event so for example you want to you want to run a flow when an item will be added to the list then you can uh, select this automated flow same way you can see here you can uh, you can select schedule uh, uh, cloud flow where you can uh, uh, choose when and uh, how the flow will trigger so you can schedule that options for this particular example i will select uh, this one instant flow and on this i will give a flow name so i will say delete all items flow uh, and then uh, you can see the, i will select the first option which is saying manually trigger a flow uh, uh, then it will actually come in a flow uh, mobile app if you are using then button will come you can simply uh, press on that i think i have covered in previous uh, videos as well now click on create so once you click on create this is the page where you, you come up and from here you can add it so uh, the steps will be you can see here uh, we will retrieve all the items then we'll do a for each loop and within that we will call our delete item method so simple things are there uh, if you will think of a program integrally concept so now same thing we will do using in this flow so click on next step and here uh, you can search for get items and you can you can see here uh, the first one get items uh, so uh, the second one you can see here which will get all the items from this particular SharePoint list so I'll select the site address first of all in this case I will select my site here SP guides and once you select it it will show you all the list in this case it is our user email list now all these items are there so click on next step in this case now we will do a for each so um, in this case I will select control so you will be able to see all all these controls here in this case we will see apply to each so that means we'll read every item and we will uh, do the action so here if we'll select you can see the value so list of items so we require all this list of items that means value will have all the list of items now and within this uh, on this particular uh, loop you can see there is add action box uh, add an action option where we will uh, use delete one so i will select for delete and if you look at here there will be select uh, sharepoint uh, delete item is there select it and once you select it you can see here again we will have to select uh, the site you can see i select sp guides then list name our user email list and in this case we will select the item id because based on that only it will uh, uh, it will do that so it is a very simple uh, example but we will be easily able to delete all the items so now save this flow so we our flow is saved now uh, you can see here it is saving so once it will save it completely you can see here no error warnings nothing is there um, anytime if you open the flow you can see here uh, there is a test button uh, you can test it or let's say this will be available if you will go to uh, this my flows you, here you can see okay uh, I already have one 
flow on that so that's the reason it take uh, delete all items hyphen 2 so you can select anytime you will be able to see the details of this flow um, uh, you can also run it you can see a run it button here you can it will run it or you can also select from here and you can say run it so click over here and you can see it will ask you to sign in all these things i'll say continue because i want that user uh, that will uh, that user account it and here you can see there is a run flow button click over here and you can see flow run successfully uh, you can you can click over here you can go or you can say done and then if you'll click over here uh, you will be able to see history as well you can see nine second a quote has been run click over here and then you will be able to see the details all are uh, a green tick mark so you can see here and then uh, that means everything executed successfully now if i'll open this list you can see here no item is there so that means everything has been deleted i have also written a complete blog post on the same with screenshot with steps so you can follow that i'll put the link in the video description so if you want similar kind of videos then subscribe to our youtube channel you'll get a lot of free videos on office 365 sharepoint office um, sharepoint online and then power platform spfx all these videos you will get it free thank you and have a nice day